Hi guys, Toby here for TP23 Productions. Now, I've got a game review. It's a game that I randomly decided to start playing uh, the other day. Uh, that game in question is the game called Homefront on the PS3. So far from what I can gather in the film, I am still playing it. It is on the screen right now behind the camera. It's not a bad sort of concept of, uh, of a game. However, when the game was made back in uh, 2011, well, three years ago, um, this was all made up fan fiction sort of thing however since the game has been made it's kind of come to life um, the Korean leader Kim Jong-il did actually die recently there was actually tension between the United States and Korea and his son Kim Jong-un is uh, currently pissed at uh, the United States so yeah it's, um, it's a game that was made as uh, a bit of fiction a bit of fun set in the near future however in the present day it's kind of come true however the fact of Kim Jong Il dying and his son Kim Jong, Kim Jong Un coming to power and uh, kind of pointing missiles at uh, America it's kind of come true and it's a bit like oh this is a bit of uh, a reality game however Homefront the north and south of Korea have joined forces to make a super Korean power that have decided to go and invade uh, America it is a first person shooter, you play as part of the resistance, you play Robert Jacobs and uh, you are a former US Marines Corps pilot, um, so you've flown all the uh, helicopters and all that sort of thing, you are rudely awakened by the Korean power and uh, sent to re-education center in Alaska. However the bus that you're on that is sending you to uh, Alaska gets hit by a truck. This truck is then uh, shown as passengers for a guy who is now there to help you called Connor and Rihanna. This is where your friendship begins, uh, this is where the story starts, you are given a gun, you are told you are now part of the resistance whether you like it or not. Uh, it's not too bad of a game, um, like I have said in 2011 this was made and uh, it was all science fiction, however it is now um, kind of reality which makes it a bit daunting and a bit scary. Um, Gameplay is not too bad. The locking system I have noticed is a bit shit. You could be aiming that far away from them without uh, the sight being used. So shooting from the hip, you're that far away. You aim at them and it doesn't lock on almost. Um, so the aiming's a bit crap. I think if the aiming system locked onto the person that you're aiming at, I think that'd be a lot better. I have noticed that characters do lag a bit. So you could be ready, waiting at a door and uh, there'll be a bit of a shuffle and like a standoff between you and Rihanna or Connor for example. You know, you're both, or all three of you are vying uh, to get a position through a door, so that gets a bit annoying. Um, so you are waiting for characters to catch up, even if you're in front of them. Um, you know, you're ready, raring to go and they're a couple of hundred yards behind you. Uh, so that's a bit shit, but it's not too bad. You play in a first-person view. I think I think if it was uh, a third-person view, I think it'd be a lot better. Um, but Homefront is not too bad. Currently playing it at the minute. Um, it's the Koreans have joined uh, joined forces North and South Korea, and uh, the aim to piss off the Americans and destroy them. So yeah, you're part of the resistance, kicking ass against the Koreans. It's not too bad of a uh, of a game set in futuristic America um, but yeah it's not too bad it's a bit old now uh, you could probably pick it up for a couple of quid but it's an alright game um, also we the devoted links down below as per usual in my YouTube videos if you want to get some money off use my promo code TOBYWTD gets your money off any we the devoted items you decide to purchase links down below as per usual but guys thanks for watching my uh, pretty quick review of Homefront the game hope you enjoy it Thanks for watching. Hi guys, Toby here for TP23 Production. You fucking cockaboro bastard. Fucking birds. In the present day, um, it's kind of come true. It